AI is the future. AI will solve everything. AI powered toothbrush will revolutionize your morning routine. Let me guess, you've probably heard the phrase AI powered so many times it's basically meaningless. AI is everywhere, but how do we know if an AI tool is actually useful or just marketing hype? So today we're learning how to separate the legit AI tools from the overhyped garbage, and then you'll get to dream up your own AI creation. Hey everybody, welcome back to AI Unlocked, a series brought to you by MediaWise and PBS News Through Reporting Lab, where we break down the world of artificial intelligence in ways that you can actually understand. First up, how do we evaluate these so-called AI tools? Check out this new app, AI Powered Homework Helper. Sounds amazing, right? But wait, is it actually good? Here's some things that you can do to find out. First, who's behind this thing? Is it made by an established tech company with AI expertise? a random developer who watched one YouTube tutorial? Or worse, is it possible to even figure out who created this? We found this homework helper AI tool, and while they do state the name of the company that produces it, it's based in Australia. So it's hard to tell if this tool would meet the right educational standards if you're maybe studying in a different country. And pro tip, if a company won't tell you who they are, they're probably hoping you won't look too closely at what they're doing with your data. Second, what's the cost? Is it free? premium or premium. Unless it's offered by a legit non-profit educational group, if something's not totally free, you are probably the product. And remember, your data is valuable. Third, privacy check. What data does this tool collect? Where does it go and can you even delete it? If the privacy policy is as long as one of your history teacher's lectures, that's a red flag to watch out for. Fourth, is it reliable? Does it actually work as advertised? Check reviews from real users not just the five-star ones that the company cherry-picked. And finally, does it comply with your school's tech policies? Because remember, even the coolest AI tool in the world won't help if using it gets you in trouble. Now for the fun part, taking AI to its limits. When you're testing an AI tool, don't just accept whatever it gives you. Challenge it. So if ChatGPT tells you that George Washington had a pet dinosaur, call it out. Or if an image generator gives you a person with six fingers, point it out. Remember, AI isn't some all-knowing digital god. It's just a tool built by humans to recognize patterns and give a response. And it makes mistakes, lots of them. But it also does adjust itself when it's corrected. Try asking the same question in different ways and push it to reveal its sources and provide links that you can check. When it gives you facts, verify them elsewhere. It's really important to know that AI systems might provide links to sources that don't actually contain the information they cite. So don't just ask for links to sources. Check those links and make sure that they're legit. And definitely try to mess with it a little. Try to break it and see where the guardrails are. You can ask questions like, what do you do with my data? Or what restrictions and limitations are programmed into your responses? Here's a secret. Once you know an AI tool's limits, you can actually use it better. You'll know what tasks it can do well and what it's not very good at. So remember to question everything and always verify. All right, now it's your turn to get creative. What AI tool would you create? Think about problems in your life that maybe AI could help solve. Maybe it's an AI study buddy that organizes your homework based on due dates, or a music composer that helps you create original tracks for your videos, or even an AI fashion assistant that helps you shop sustainably. Okay, okay, here's my idea. What about an AI tool that scans your entire fridge, tells you what meals you can make with what you have, and factors in your family's dietary restrictions? There's gonna be no more, there's nothing to eat moments. Now it's your turn. Take five minutes to brainstorm your own AI tool idea. Think about what problems does it solve, who would use it, what data would it need, and how would you make sure it's ethical? The cool thing is, some of you watching right now might actually build these tools someday. The future of AI isn't just about what big tech companies create. It's about what you decide AI should be used for. So go ahead, question the AI hype, push these tools to their limits, and then imagine something better. Because being skeptical doesn't mean ignoring new technology. It means being smart with it. Thanks for joining us and be sure to follow at MediaWise and at Student Reporting Labs on YouTube, TikTok, and Instagram to see all our videos.